Hello friends, nice to see you back. In this video, we are going to learn to new property from SQL command. What are by and distinct? You can see a dummy student table. And you can see the first column is name, which is not sorted by order. And I want to be sorted by order. As you can see, after A, student name started with S, Smith and Sophia. I want the names, those who started with A to came first. And then I want to see those students who was started with B. Similarly, I want to order students by their name, means ascending order, something like that. If I set ascending order for name column, according to the table, after add one, it return Emma, because E come first from S. If you notice, Smith and Sophia, both of the name start with S. But the second character of Smith, M, come first, then O. So it's going to print Smith before then Sophia. So, here we have set our table in a ascending order. Set ascending order or descending order, we need to use a special keyword named order by. As you can see on your screen, first you need to type order by keyword and then you need to provide the column name. In our case, name. And then we need to provide which order we want to set. We have two types of orders, ascending or descending. If you want to go with ascending, then you need to type ASC. But if you want to go with descending order, then you need to type DESC. If we set this column descending, then it will start working from the opposite direction. I want to say it going to start from Z. Let's see how we can use order by command using select command. First we need to type select command, then we need to provide columns name. And if you want to see all the columns, you can type star. And then we need to use from keyword. And we need to provide the table name. And we need to use order by keyword. And then we need to provide the columns name, which we want to order in. We can order multiple columns in one table. Just we need to use comma between columns name. And then we need to provide the order format. Ascending, otherwise descending. If you want to go with ascending, then you need to type ASC. And for descending, you need to type DESC. Ascending order is default. Ascending order is default order. If you use order by keyword, by default, it's run ascending order. So let's start the practical and see how it's work. You can see on your screen, I already opened my XAM control panel and I also opened MySQL Workbench application. First I'm going to start Apache server and then I'm going to start MySQL server. Now our server is ready for connection. So I'm going to double click on my connection name. Here you can see our SQL editor and you also can see our tables. And I'm going to show you the personal table. So I'm going to double click on it. And you can see we have four students in our table. Add one Anna Susmita Rahul. And here I want to order the column name. If you look closely, you will see that S come first, then S come R. So I'm going to order this column name and print student name alphabetically. So I'm going to type select star from personal and then I'm going to use order by key and then we need to provide column name which is name that's it if I execute this code you can see and this time you can see R character print first then the S character is being printed first of all it's going to print all the names who are start with A and then it's going to print those names who are start with B it's going to print name alphabetically means A to Z. And if you want to show this data in a descending order, yes, we can. Just we need to type D E S C. And if I execute this code, you can see now it's print all the name in a descending order. First it prints Shushmita, then it's print Rahul, then it's print Anna. At last it print add one. Here you can see I do not use any condition. If we want to use a condition, yes, we can. Just we need to type where keyword where city equal to inside the quotation Delhi. If I execute this code, you can see those students who are from Delhi. And also it print their name in a descending order. First it prints Sushmita, then come Anna, at last add one. We can do ordering any of column here. So I'm going to remove this line. And I'm going to order H column. So I'm going to remove this column name and I'm going to type H. For now, I don't want to descending order, so I'm going to remove 
DESC. If I execute this code, you can see it order our H column 18, 18, 19, 20. Not only that, we can order two columns at once. Name, comma, city. If I execute the code, you can see. So first it going to order name column. Then according to name column, it going to order city column. So we can execute multiple column ordering at once. Let's talk about our another method. Listing. 